Welcome to Free Academic English. I'm Geraldine and today's video is going to be about practical tips when deciding if taking TOEFL or IELTS. I have a series of videos explaining the differences between TOEFL and IELTS, but if you want something more practical, I'll tell you. One of the first things to know is the score you need, because the place you are applying to gives you a score in both TOEFL or IELTS. So, to be practical, if the score you need is low, low meaning 4 or 5 IELTS, 60 TOEFL, go for IELTS. Yeah, go for IELTS, because in IELTS, in all the parts of the exam, in all the skills, there's a level, there's an increasing level. So, if your level is lower, you will be more comfortable with the first parts with some readings, with the first part of the listening, uh, with speaking, you will have one person who can explain the questions to you. So if you need a lower score, I'll go for IELTS and start preparing for that exam. Besides, in IELTS, in the listening part, for example, you can see the questions ahead and that's a big, big advantage if your level is low. So basically having somebody to explain the questions to you in the speaking section and to read the questions for the listening section before you listen to the actual audio is very advantageous if you are a basic intermediate web. So low score, IELTS. Now, if you need a higher score or higher than that, 80 and above or 6 and above, then it won't depend much on the exam, but on the skills you have. Then you have to consider three main things. Consider the accent you understand better, American or British. Consider how you feel more comfortable working on screen or pencil on paper. Consider how you feel more comfortable talking to record your answers in a very short time or to interact with a person but without those, times those time constraints that TOEFL has. The length of the exam was something I used to take into consideration, but TOEFL has shortened the, lay, the length, so that's no longer a difference. Let me know what you choose and why. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, share, and I hope to see you soon.